um, the biggest question that a lot of people always ask or ask any person is, can a man and a woman be friends, you know? And this movie sheds a little bit of light on that. You know, um, there's a lot of close men and women that are best friends. I have a lot of times it's the accusation of them being together or are they really, you know, having something on the low? And that movie, the movie sheds a lot of light on that. Also, um, it does, you know, show you how, you know, relationships aren't easy and sometimes you have to be, you know, more calm and wait things out, evaluate a situation before you just start making a lot of quick actions. My character, Natalie, makes a lot of quick actions. I won't say, but she makes a lot of quick actions in the movie because of things that she thinks. And from outside of looking at it, we can show a lot of people in our, that are in the same situation. Sometimes you got to think before you act. To close that talk, I would just say, all you need in a relationship also is trust. <laughs> Who are you texting? How's a grown man gonna have a woman for a best friend and a roommate? No! You, you're nothing but a selfish whore. The story is a love triangle, a twist. It's, I would say, something that every, well, not every woman, but a lot of women have been through at some time in their life. It shows fashion, it's about music, entertainment. It's a little bit of everything. And I think that's what makes it so well-rounded. But of course. Your character, tell us about your character. Well, of course, I play the role of Woody. And Woody is a slick man. Very slick. Which is married and fall in love with a female which is Natalie, who has a fiance I never knew about. Mm. Isn't that something? Did I get mad when I found out she was engaged to be married? Too much information. <laughs> Too much information. Well, let me tell you, I'm going to tell you again. Did I get married? It's she to find out September 29, 2013, right here at Party So Cinema. You're going to come and see another relationship, like two couples who's living or three couples or whatever, what's going on in their life. And you can compare yours to that and like, oh my God, I thought I was worse or I thought I've been through worse, you yeah. understand? So is that every relationship, there's an up and down and you better believe it. So this is why I want you to come out and see how couples are living and what happened and the mistake they make so you can learn from those mistakes so you don't make them. One of the things that honestly I really would say that I really love about this movie is that remember around the time when we were shooting the, the um, Earth, Earthquake in Haiti? Of course, yes. I love the fact that the tribute is there, you know, because so many lives and so many people were affected by the earthquake. The fact that the movie ties in a tribute to the earthquake, I think that was really big and I really love that. And to add to that, just so I can remind my people, all y'all who lost your love one at a time. Viniga de mon vie encore, 29 septembre 2013, la ville fortelle d'Al, dans Paradiso Cinema.